Welcome back to Pokemon Soul Silver. Uh, last time we took out Red and caught Mewtwo. This time around, we're going to be taking on the round two, second round of the Elite Four. Uh, this round activates after you get all eight badges in the Kanto League. So we are going to get going. All of the Elite Four members now have six Pokemon. And after looking at their levels, I don't think I'm that afraid overall. Um, I'm actually higher level than the Elite Four. All my Pokemon are higher level than all the Pokemon of the Elite Four. So that's kind of unfortunate, but uh, it's going to be more of the endurance is going to be the problem here. <clears throat> uh, I hope I didn't have to do anything besides get the badges. And six Pokemon. And his starter is a Bronzong. That's a bit different from uh, his Zatu's. Uh, let's see, what should we start off with here? Uh, it is a Steel type, so let's just go straight for... I'm drawing a blank as to what Steel and Dark efficiency is. So let's try that. That sounded like a normal hit. Yep. That was a uh, super effective. <clears throat> but he has leftovers because I went and looked up the items. Black Sludge. I was incorrect last time. Uh, the Black Sludge. Oh, that was that was good. That was good. Black Sludge is actually the poison healing item. I was confusing it with an item that just bumped up uh, poison type attacks, but no, it's actually leftovers for poison types. So uh, I kind of swapped out leftovers on. Uh, sorry, one sec. I swapped out the uh, leftovers on Rex for the, in place of the poison orb. So he gets healed by it. Uh, the poison orb, uh, it heals, and if it's being held by a poison type, it heals him, heals them, like leftovers does. But if it's held by any other Pokemon, it uh, poisons them. <clears throat> so it's a uh, pretty much an item that can only be used by poison types, so give it to Rex. Uh, and I just gave leftovers to Rex. Or not, uh, to, to Kowanger. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately this is probably going to be a bit of a wash. My leveling up before doing this was mainly to kill Red. <clears throat> uh, I wanted to make sure I could kill Red. And uh, I, w I barely did it, man. Like, uh, without items, I meant. Like, most of these battles, I've been trying to do them without items or with minimal item usage. Like, the I would have used items, but only if I was in, like, a desperate situation and absolutely needed to. Um... <clears throat> like, there was a couple times. I think la lately in these fights, I think I threw used three hyper potions in one fight. I think. I can't remember what fight it was, but I remember I had to use them. <clears throat> what did I give Spooks? I gave Spooks... Uh, I can't remember what essence it was. Rose? I think it's the Rose essence. Increases the Grass-type attacks, so... I saw the full restore coming, so I decided to use Magical Leaf for a weaker, basically, a weaker move. Because I'm going to ship away a little bit of health. And then I'm going to Shadow Ball to kill it. Because <clears throat> it was critical off of one Shadow Ball, this will just ensure it's dead. Instead of using the strong move to get it to critical and killing it afterwards. And risking it using another item. Just weaken it a little bit, and then go for the jugular. Keep up the Shadow Balls, see what happens. Bam, bam, bam. So yeah, the Elite Four Round 2 uh, National Dex is open to them, so you're going to see a lot of Pokemon from the other regions uh, in the uh, first four generations of the game before this. Uh, I'm going to try to keep my Pokemon kind of balanced here. <clears throat> I need to make sure I keep some Thunders, because I'll need some for later. I'm, I 
I'm assuming I need to close this page. It's actually got I left the page with the levels on and I was looking at the levels. I didn't look at any of the Pokemon but <clears throat> during the match, but I just looked over, realized that the I was about to look up the what the Pokemon coming up were and I was like, wait, no, don't do that. Be surprised. I don't think I've ever done this. I might have, but I've completely forgotten about the entire Elite Four round two. <clears throat> so that was kind of one of the reasons why I wanted to go through with this, because I found out when doing research that I've had to, I can uh, do this, so. <clears throat> yeah, 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 that's fine. Let's go away. I mashed it. Why am I pushing that? There we go. Just put the stylus away, it's loud. Uh, <clears throat> Next up is Koga with poison types. I'm gonna switch out Rex. He's the most defensive. I'm not sure what he starts with. <clears throat> uh, uh, when I was training, I bought a bunch of items, so I didn't really buy anything before going into this. <clears throat> I had a hundred high potion, hyper potions at some point. Cool. That went off with pretty much. Pre that went pretty much with off with. That pretty much went off without a hitch, so I'm just gonna save up and we will continue on our merry way. <clears throat> Let's see, that took six minutes. Let's see if we can get three done and then we can do a one final wrap-up episode. <clears throat> Koga of the Elite Four, Confusion, Sleep, Poison. Guess what? You won't poison my first poke, bitch. He's already poisoned! Oh god, where'd he come from? Skunk tank. Hey, guess what? I got an earthquake for you. <clears throat> I'm so glad I got two Pokemon with earthquake. Earthquake is like my favorite attack in this game. It's so strong. Like, really, it's so powerful. Oh no, it's a Venomoth. It's such a good move. <laughs> uh oh, that's not cool. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I did not want to start that spiral. <laughs> thank you, Rex. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, does he have anything that's not weak to Earthquake? Um, um, oh, he has leftovers. Cool. Don't use Sludge Bomb. I'm just gonna have to use Earthquake again. I'm not, I'm wanting, not wanting to use up so much Earthquake PP already. Um, might switch out to Tusker here. Crobat. Yeah, perfect timing. Yeah, let's go to Tusker. We'll use Avalanche. Crobat will probably be faster than most of my Pokemon anyway. Actually, probably faster than all my Pokemon. Except for maybe... Uh... Oh, this is good. The only Pokemon might be faster is Carbuncle. I think Carbuncle... Carbuncle is my fastest poke. And it's fast! Damn you, crits! <clears throat> Crobat should be dead. Never Melt Ice is still on Tusker, powering up his Ice-type attacks. Avalanche has 120 power when... Uh, when I am hit in the same turn, I use it. So, yeah. Toxic Croak, Poison Fighting. Oh no, wait, no, it's... Yeah, it's Poison Fighting, isn't it? Or is it Poison Dark? Crap! Brain Fart! I'm going for it, I'm pretty sure it's fighting! <laughs> oh, thank god! <laughs> It should be dead. I'm pretty sure that's quad strong. <laughs> oh god. I just had a huge brain fart. I was fairly certain it's poison fighting. <laughs> oh man. Just have one of those moments where you just like forget everything you know about a subject. <clears throat> uh, you're level 66 now, so let's swap you out. Let's send Tusker back in. Well, Earthquake. And, uh, might need to do a second Earthquake if Tusker lives, but, uh, if Tusker can live and Muck lives the Earthquake, 
You've been counting on this from the very beginning. The only Pokemon you've been able to hit was the one that used the attack that makes him go after the opponent. And I used that against your fastest Pokemon knowing that I wouldn't outspeed it. <laughs> I... That's pretty much a sweep for me. I, I would consider that... It, I know it's not technically a sweep. I didn't, like, take out all six of his Pokemon with single attacks. But, like, come on. <laughs> Only one Pokemon actually took damage. And it was damage I knew I wanted it to take. <laughs> <clears throat> kind of sucked that it was a uh, crit, but... Whatevs. Um, Bruno. Let's throw Sora out there. Honestly, Sora is not that good for the Elite Four. <clears throat> but, uh, who knows? We might have some chance here. He tried to learn Earth Slash, uh, Air Slash, sorry. But, uh, he's sort of a physical attacker, so. Plus, Fly. Fly is important for me. <clears throat> Hit him on top, eh? Okay. Oh crap, I just realized I don't have the attack animations on. I'm so dumb. I apologize, everyone, but... I just completely forgot about it, because I've been playing this entire game without the uh, attack animations on, just to make everything go faster when I was training. Well, Sora, thank you! Um, that kind of... happened. Let's just go and psychic everything to death. That's nice, Bruno. Yeah, you do that. I will turn on the attack animations for the last episode. <laughs> oh well, it's not you missing too much here. You guys have seen almost everything so far. Keep battling. Hariyama's just a physical attacker. The only time, only thing I'm gonna switch out is for is if it has a, a rock type. I'm assuming he'll still have his Machamp. Yeah, there's Hitmon top. Don't know if he'll have Hitmon and Hitmon. Yeah, there's his Machamp. Does he have only fighting types now? Because I kind of considered him sort of a rock. I don't know why. I always considered him a rock fighter just become gen 1 he had like I don't know it's kind of weird <clears throat> guess he's the fighting elite 4 member doo -doo -doo. and I guess I'm just gonna sweep with psychics and that'll be that yeah really If it uses Mock Punch, it'll get some damage on me. Didn't I win? <laughs> um, this has been an exciting match. I wonder if I can take out the fourth member before the last episode here. Oh, Lucario. That's different. Uh, that's Steel. Can't remember Psychic versus Steel. I don't think it's good. But you know what is good? Earthquake. <laughs> Close combat. Oh shit. Why didn't I why did I forget about ice? I'm dead. I live! Tusker lives! An earthquake will kill cause definitely! Not only because it's super effective, but because he lowered his own defensive powers. Oh, the hubris. Oh, the damn luck that I lived. <laughs> okay, first things first. Options. Battle scene on. Confirm. There you go. Now the attack animations are back on. Uh, let's revive everybody. And uh, I still got... Do I really want to... You know what, let's go for it. <clears throat> I 
We'll take out the Elite Four this episode. Next time, I'll do a wrap-up. If we have enough time, maybe I'll go and try to... I don't know. I have no idea. Next episode might be short. You know what? No, I'm going to cut off the episode here. Just because I won't have anything to do next episode if I... Like, it's going to just be the one fight. Uh... Yeah, so next time we're going to take on the last member of the Elite Four of the game. Or maybe I should just make this... No, I'm just going to make this a long episode. Final episode of the series. Let's just make this a really long episode. Alright, take out the everything at once. Screw it, we'll just do it. There we Let's have some fun. <clears throat> These Elite Four battles are going a lot quicker than I thought they would. Do. They would. Mainly because I've been over-leveled. But, uh... Whatevs. Uh, next is Dark... So let's throw Quanger out there. Let's do a quick save. <clears throat> Need another drink. It's just Pepsi, I don't drink alcohol. <clears throat> not sure how many people actually assume. I don't know. I'm not sure. Like, I feel like the young, like, I don't know why, I know a lot of people that don't drink. And I feel- I don't know how, like, prevalent that is in the previous generations. And how, like, if it's becoming more commonplace to have less drinking, I don't know. Uh, you are gonna be faster than me. By a lot. Weavile's actually a very fast Pokémon. But it's also dead, because this is quad effective against it. <clears throat> and we will gauge what we use after this. <clears throat> okay, next up. I actually remember, I'm pretty sure I know what Pokemon's coming up. I think it's Honchkrow. Yeah, there it is. That's the one Pokemon, when I looked up at the page earlier, I mentioned I had that, the uh, site with a... Uh, Elite Four on it. Uh, Lance's Pokemon wasn't on there, actually. Although I did see, I know he has a... I know... I know he has a Dragonite, and there's one other po couple other Pokemon I saw. Couple other Dragon types that aren't... <clears throat> aren't... weren't in Generation 2, or 3, or 1. <clears throat> um... Blizzard. <clears throat> Sorry. Something caught in my throat right now. I cannot remember the rest of your poke. Pokes, so. Hopefully he sends out like a grass type or something. Spiritum has no elemental weaknesses. <clears throat> it is a ghost dark type. It's actually one of two Pokemon that have no elemental weaknesses in this generation. I think it's weak to Fairy in the future generations, but... I have no idea what I'm going to use on this. Can't use... Don't want to use Sora. I just need to power through it. I'm thinking... Yeah, let's just go with Rex. I hope it doesn't have a Psychic attack. <clears throat> It's kind of funny, Rex is actually probably, overall, is actually the weakest in attack power, but it's the most versatile. Nidoking's a very good Pokemon overall. Like, it's actually just a strong, average everything. Like, it's good spirit, uh, you bastard. <clears throat> yeah, it's a very good Pokemon overall, it's just like, in comparison to, like, all the rest of my team members have some sort of... Ooh, That's not good. I forgot, Spirit Tomb's the, uh... kind of, uh... a cheesy... enemy that has a bunch of those weird status ailments. <clears throat> He killed himself, and I'm just gonna swap out. <clears throat> <clears throat> Good for you, Spiritomb. Good for you. Do, do, do. 
Uh, let's switch back to Quare. <clears throat> if only you had Mega Evolutions, Mega Absol would have been kind of cool here. <laughs> Close combat! Let's make sure it dies. <clears throat> I'm faster than it? I thought Absol was pretty fast. Although Quanger is pretty fast over as well, actually. Good old Hercules Beetle. Good old leftovers. Hound Doom. If I'm faster than it, I kill it. If it's faster than me, I die. <clears throat> I'm faster, it's dead. Now, the question is, does it have Flamethrower or Fire Blast? Well, we will not find out, especially since I got that critical. You know what? Just sweep it. <coughs> sweep the rest of the battle. The only question will be is if it will survive. Umbreon is a pretty good tank. <coughs> It's possible it can live. But not today! The Kowanger is too strong. People wanted me to get rid of that move. <laughs> <clears throat> the champion is waiting. Okay, let's heal up. And get ready for the final fight. And I'm gonna throw Carbuncle in front. If it has Gyarados, I'll kill it with Thunderbolt. If it has a Dragon, I will kill it with Blizzard. Carbuncle's sort of the ace in the hole kills a Pokemon. If it hits. Against Lance. <clears throat> I'm not sure if I just saved like 14 times. I have this tendency in games, like in RPGs, that when I'm doing stuff, I will just save, like if I save once, I will save like 14 times in the next five minutes after that. Like I'll be doing menu things, I'll save before the menus. I'll for some reason start saving halfway through the menus and then right at the end I'll save again. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm sorry, I already defeated Red. You're, like, nothing to me, Lance. <laughs> Salamence, you are fire and dra flying and dragon. I almost said fire. I still think that the one thing Pokemon games... You are faster than me. You are level 72, sir. This... You, I lived... Oh, thank God. <laughs> I still think the one thing Pokemon games should do, like, if they wanted to majorly change the entire gameplay of Pokemon, give them a third element. Like, so many Pokemon are already set up for it. Like, Salamence, just give it the, fi the fire type. Uh, Charizard, give it the dragon type it needs. Water Dragon Flying for Gyarados. There's so many Pokemon that are already set up for it. I This is bad timing, actually. Um. <clears throat> you are going to use... <sighs> I am faster. I... Damn it. <clears throat> I don't want to switch into Carbuncle right now, because if he's using Hyper Beam, my Carbuncle dies. Da -da 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 -da. Uh, Quanger's not going to help out too much in this, I don't think, so... That's actually not that bad of a thing. Because if I do get an attack off, it will be more powerful due to Guts. 
It's only level 68, I should have lived through this. Ah, you bitch. The para flinching. This is really awkward because he used Gyarados right after Carbuncle was already out. So. Give me a crit! Aww. If it gave me a crit, it probably would have died. That was a crit. I didn't think it was. Oh, that's not good. This gives me a chance. Here we go. He's going to heal with a full restore. <clears throat> gives me the chance to switch into Carbuncle. And I still have Quanger later. <clears throat> Hit it. Thank you. Dead. <laughs> As I said, Carbuncle's just the one hit, one hitter quitter. Uh, Garchomp is next. Uh, this would have been good for Dragon Pulse, but I don't have that. I made that decision. Let's go with Avalanche. Hopefully I'll, I'll, I'll survive whatever attack he uses on me. <laughs> Probably use something that's super effective against me, but we'll see. Oh! Use Swords Dance. That's... I hope this kills. <laughs> chance it could. Yes! <laughs> so happy that killed. Yes, I'm definitely switching. Are you kidding me? This is like, like, this is Carbuncle's, like, one guaranteed use in this fight. Because <clears throat> Surf... I'd laugh if Surf missed. I know it can't, but I'd laugh if it did. <clears throat> like, turns out Charizard's holding that item that increases its evasion. Makes it, gives it a more chance to, uh, dodge attacks. Altaria. Well, Tusker didn't take any damage, so I might as well switch back into him. <laughs> Don't paralyze, please. <laughs> Thank you. Goodbye. Seriously, my team is set up to kill Lance so well. <laughs> I'm getting kind of lucky, though. Um... Now let's keep battling. <clears throat> Come on! Oh shit! <laughs> well, thank you for your contribution, Tusker. You did your job. Um, leave it to the rest of the team. We'll take the rat and we'll take it from here. <laughs> Uh, you better be faster. Yes, and that's all she wrote! Thank you and good night. <clears throat> if you live, I'm gonna be pissed. You better not live. Thank you. Oh, Carbuncle too good. Carbuncle was set up to destroy every Pokemon in, on his team, and the rest of the members were meant to allow him, Carbuncle to use different attacks. Oh, and that's how we do. Oh, I'm glad to be done. Do. So, uh, with all that said, uh, people probably are wondering if I'm going to be doing it. I will be doing the new Pokemon games. I have a couple of plans. 
uh, Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, if you're watching this series sometime in the distant future. If you are, watch the other series. Uh, if you are new to the channel, and we're just watching this series, and this is the first Pokemon series you've been watching, I did a playthrough of Emerald. It's actually one of my favorite series I've done. Uh, that's where I got the uh, Robert name from for the uh, the rival. Go watch that if you want to learn more. <clears throat> and uh, yeah, good old Carbuncle, level 67 at the end. That's cool. Kawanger, level 65. Met in a town. My girl spooks, Miss Magius. The uh, ever rising Sora, the Pidget, level sixty-five. Rex, the Nido King, wrecked all of them. And the. Uh, Powerful god of the Tusk, uh, the uh, Tusk race, Tusker. Bam! Don't pay attention to the time. There was moments where I was standing still. Um, yeah. Sweet. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I do plan on doing a playthrough for Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. It'll probably be blind. <coughs> uh. As blind as it can be, I know the games fairly well. I obviously did a playthrough of Emerald. Um, I do have some plans for what I'm going to be doing for him, uh, but uh, I don't know. I don't really have any ideas for a team because it's a blind playthrough, so I don't know where po certain Pokemon are going to be appearing. <clears throat> uh, I don't know. We'll see what happens. I think I'll actually use a starter, just because of the uh, Mega Evolutions. What Pokemon starter I use, I think I have an idea. I don't know, I'm kind of looking forward to it. Although I'm kind of pissed it's coming out on the same day as Smash Bros Wii U. Robert, you dick! <laughs> Shove me out of the way. Hey, it's Faulkner and Bugsy. Stupid illegal Pidgey. Oh, Pidgeotto. Pichu! Togepi! Whitney. And the Clefairy and the Mill Tank. I can't even remember that guy's name. I know it's... I know it's Morty. I can't remember the other guy's name! <laughs> he was taunting us with Suicune the entire time, isn't it? Eugene or Yusin? Yusin? Hey, hi, Chuck. Hey, Jasmine! You're cool! <laughs> Lance and Claire. Oh crap. Crap. Crap! Wait, wait. I'll think of it. I don't even know. I know one of you is Proton. <laughs> and a Slowpoke. Like, slight as in not the Pokemon, but... Hey, Lance. And me! I'm still trying to think of the name. Will, Koga, Bruno, and Karen. God, he spinned himself to disappearance. God damn it, I can't name remember his name. Another Uh Price! 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 Yes, I nailed it. I was about to cheat and look it up, but I didn't. <laughs> I remember it. Hi mom! I think that's mom. <laughs> Don't remember. Saw her briefly. <clears throat> The end! Yeah. Anyways, thanks everybody for watching. Tune in for my next playthrough. I don't know when it will start, but uh, I've got 
I don't know. I need to figure out what I'm going to do next anyway. Anyways, yep. Thank you all for watching. Talk to you all later. Bye.